Welcome to the tutorial on Concept Maps in Teaching and Learning. In this tutorial, we will learn to add a note to a node, copy text from another program, add icon to a node, join nodes, import directory structures and import another concept map. To record this tutorial, I am using Ubuntu Linux version 16.04 OS, Freeplane 1.7.10 and Gedit 3.18. To follow this tutorial, learner must be familiar with the Freeplane interface. For prerequisite tutorials, please visit this site. Files used in this tutorial are provided in the code files link. Please download and extract the files. Make a copy and use them while practicing. Go to desktop. I have saved the input files on desktop. Select the file teaching.mm. Double click on the file icon and open the map in free play. This is a map on solar system. Let's add descriptive details to nodes using the note feature. Let's add a node to the moon node. For this, select the node and right click to open the context menu. From the menu, click on the edit note in dialog. This opens an edit note dialog box. Formatted text and labels can be added to notes from here. I will add a description about moon here. We may type the desired text in the form. I will type details on moon for title and press enter. If the text is already present in the computer, it can also be copied here. Go to desktop. I have the details in a file named moon.txt in the desktop directory. Double click on the file icon and open moon.txt in a text editor. You may use any text editor of your choice. Let's highlight all the text in the file and copy it. Let's close the text editor. Go back to Freeplane and paste the text in the notes box. You may format the text, font and alignment if desired. I will leave it as is and click on the OK button. Notice an icon of paper and pencil appears next to the moon node. Hover the cursor over the node to see the notes as tooltip. Next. Let's add icons to the sun node. Click on the arrow seen on the middle left side to open the icons panel. You may also click on view controls and check the box for icons toolbar. I had hyperlinked an mp3 audio file to the node. Learner may pause the video and click on the node to play it. I want to add a sound speaker icon to it from the icons list. Select the sun node. Scroll down the icons toolbar. The icon will help to identify the link as an audio file without clicking on it. To locate the speaker icon, click on it to insert it on the selected node. The icon appears on the sun node. Next, let's explore the join or merge node option. Select the teaching aids node and notice the three child nodes on it. They are force, velocity and acceleration. The teacher wants the three concepts together on one node. To merge or join the three nodes, First select all the three child nodes, then press Ctrl J to join the nodes. 
Notice the three child nodes are merged or joined as one child node. Notice that each node is in a different line. The menu alternate is found under Edit Node Core. There are many options here. Control J merges the node contents with a new line between each of them. The nodes can also be merged with a space or comma separation. Notice that we can also split a long node name into different nodes. There are many options seen here to split the node. Learner may pause the video and practice the join and the split options. Next, let's import the directory structure to the January node. I want to import the class files directory from desktop. First, select the January node. Click on File, Import and Folder Structure. Select the folder to import the dialog box opens, prompting the user to choose the folder. Choose the class files folder in the desktop directory and click on Open. Let's unfold the January node. Notice the files in the directory are hyperlinked to the node. We can also add another concept map to our existing map. I will demonstrate it next. I have a map named importmap.mm located in the desktop. This map can be imported in different ways. Each method gives a slightly different look from the other. I want to attach it to the February node. So first select February node. Select the node and right click to open the context menu. Click on link, add hyperlink, choose. A dialog box opens. Choose import map.mm and click on open. A red arrow appears next to February indicating a hyperlink. I will save the map by pressing Ctrl S. Now click on File Import Linked Branch. The map is attached to the February node through its root node. We can use the import function to add another concept map. Let's create a sibling node to February and name it Import and select it. Do not forget to save the map before importing another map. Click on File, Import, Branch. A dialog box opens, prompting for the file name. Choose Import Map.mm from the desktop folder and click on Open. The map gets attached to the import node. Notice the different ways maps or directories can get attached to the map. The file import linked branch without root is slightly different from the above. In this option, the map is imported without the root node. You may pause the video and practice this import option. Click on File Save Map to save the map. Click on File Quit Free Plane to quit free plane. Now let's summarize. In this tutorial, we added a note to a node, copied text from another program, added an icon to a node, joined to nodes, imported directory to the map, and imported a concept map. For assignment activity, please do the following. Using a map of your choice, Link a video or hyperlink to a node. Add a video icon to the node. Add icons of your choice to the nodes appropriately. Add a definition or description of a node as note to it. This video summarizes the spoken tutorial project.
Please download and watch it. The Spoken Tutorial Project team conducts workshops and gives certificates. For more details, please write to us. Please post your timed queries in the forum. Spoken Tutorial Project is funded by MHRT, Government of India. This is Rani from IIT Bombay. Thank you for joining.